Okay, here we are back in Felseal Arbor's Mark. So, where we last left off... Actually, I don't know, I may splice in some of the loot gathering around here because I imagine a couple of these may give people some trouble. The aqueduct was one that you have to know that you can drain the water, I guess. But anyway, right here we are going to complete the obelisk quest. So we need to go to the gods to your wastes. And we're looking for places that have matching coordinates. Zatsit's not important. So right here is where we're looking for. We can have someone run over there real fast. Uh, Level-wise... 45... Hmm. And we have to use these spaces, apparently. Monsters. So yeah, let's bring the bug. Uh, in case you're wondering, the bug is currently a Zatzit, which is this. And we'll get the show on the road. No point keeping you guys in suspense, right? So I'm leaning towards having him go after the fish thing, as well as the dragon. I don't know if the spines will reach from over here. Actually, I don't think I'm going to be able to reach him at all, just because of height. And there's no chance of a counter slow. Let's do it. Fleet of foot, whatever shall I do? So it's important to note this undead Kawa. Completely absorbs dark. <laughs> so look at this to her so she can start unleashing havoc. It's time for the good doctor to go on out. I genuinely don't care about the Zods, in case you're wondering. So I want to see if I can shoot him from here. That's the attack boost. Sadly, the zombie is not going to move in time. That's awkward. Debuff for your trouble. Now that one's undead too. So we'll leave the doctor alone. So 
so does he completely evade this now? Yes. So the one thing I wanted to see was, is he, he seems to be immune to magic in general. So if I were to do this... Damn. Oh well. That boosts his movement. He gets higher jump and um, more distance to move. Uh, didn't want to have to waste his move like this, but the guy's gonna move if I don't take him out. favors the bold. So we need to get rid of this charm before it becomes a problem. Some of these gadgets just outright suck. I'll go over here. Where's the dispel thing? Here. No more attack buff for you. Riddle me this a lot. Cap of Ages, Phoenix Band, Reaper, Dormant Crystal, Coronal Plume, Dark Core, Adamant Ingot. The Zolbeam makes no sense to me. They have such a bad magic stand, it literally takes everything they have. No healing for you. Okay, plan B. We need more Reiner. Two EXP off that just because of the level difference between the two. So, my one concern about this is the debuffs may get transferred back, but it looks like he even doesn't even have anything for it. None of them will connect, I mean.
Kaboom! over here and we're going to use the heal bot on Reiner. Partly because I know how much of an EXP boost I'm going to be getting off of this. They didn't show you. I don't think he's rooted anymore. Reiner's using a lance at the moment, in case you're wondering, so I want to keep two spaces at all times. Damn. You suck. We'll bring her around for insurance purposes. Even though the next holy attack will probably be the end. <laughs> So real quick, we're going to look at her level, or her EXP, I should say. Three off from leveling. That's all, folks. So once you have all the Oblast clues, go there, activate it, and so on. So you can see a nice mix of AP for the bug. We'll duck in here real quick so you can see 
Nothing new, nothing new. Hmm. So yeah, we actually do need to go back for some of these. Night, not there. Uh, she's learning her way through the plague doctor at least. Okay, we now have Ranger mastered. <laughs> At this point, I'm kind of tempted to just go grab Scoundrel and get it over with. I'm not looking to max all the jobs on that character, it's just kind of working out that way. Want the heal burst. Grab permanence. I don't know if thorns are really any good. If there's a way to make them good, I should say. Kawa gave us meat shield. So that's basically protect, I think. That's it. So now we have their passives, which are the evasion ones. For the cadaver, we have the wild slam. For the pectite, saving. That's it. No. Getting close to maxing exile. You can tell from my voice how excited I am. But yeah, I don't know if I'm going to screw around in the arena or just try to end this. I'll have to decide by next time. I'm the Hero of Light. Thanks for watching, and goodbye. Okay, so at the dam part, I was looking for the chest to see what exactly it had. And if you notice, it's not actually here. So the question is, where could it be? They don't really tell you that those wheels can be interacted with, and I imagine it's going to lower the water level so that we can find it. But in the meantime, we kind of need to deal with the enemies who are here. So I already thinned out most of the herd. There's just a little bit left. So in case you're wondering if this thing is worth a headache, hover boots. Bleh. You can see I already have a pair on her, so... This would help you for the coming area, which has a phoenix band in its chest. You have to be able to walk on water. If you need it, that's kind of how you get it, I guess. Enjoy. Enjoy.